how do all of your calculations get affected by what's happening in the political sphere? Because you talk about Venezuela, you talk about Turkey. It's mostly about politics. Mr. Erdogan, what's happening with the Venezuelan uh, immigration crisis, the economy, but also Brazil. We're heading to another presidential election in October, which seems very risky at the moment. Um, I mean, thank goodness that it's all about politics at this stage. Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to run the portfolio. I mean, you know, we're in a, a market, a stage of the market cycle now where it's not about analyzing spreadsheets. It's um, gauging the probability of political reactions. And you're right, most of the outcomes on this are going to be dictated by politics. So the IMF stepping in for Argentina, a lot of the reason, rationale for that is political. Erdogan, a lot of the problems, I mean, I, I would argue that there are structural problems before, but this was a political issue from the get-go. He's been trying to consolidate power and has been sacrificed in the economy, you know, to do so. Um, so Same thing with Venezuela, I see. Venezuela, absolutely, and it's a political calculation. Net-net, Venezuela will be far better off resolving its problems with the United States because if you need a rebound in the oil industry, the best partners to do it with are the U.S. oil uh, companies, not the Indian ones, not the Chinese, not the Russian. So the path of least resistance for economic revival is reintegrating with the U.S. Let's see if it happens.